this is just another reminder that you should always take out some time to just sit and be quiet and you know if you can get silence perfect but if not if you're in a loud city like i am right now you can see there is the shard i'm here in london it's kind of a bit of a, a busy uh, city a lot of hustle a lot of noises going around uh, and you know sometimes it's great to just sit down for a couple of minutes and be quiet and be with your thoughts especially when you're in a busy place you know in a busy city such as London you know everyone is constantly on the hustle and the grind trying to get to the next best and biggest thing uh, and it's 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 rare that you kind of have the time to just sit and be you know we I, I practice a lot of meditation and gratitude to help me get into this state of mind uh, but every now and again it's actually kind of good to be in the actual uh, city itself and and sort of be okay with it being this noisy uh, kind of thing like it's 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 almost like if you're if you're meditating when you're in a quiet room or sat on the floor uh, you know there's no distractions you're not necessarily going to get the most out of that for when you actually need to be in that specific state Obviously, if it's quiet and there's no one distracting you, it's very easy to meditate and get yourself into a, a quiet and calm state. But if you try and do that when you're in the middle of a city, when you've got cars beeping, you've got construction workers, planes flying overhead, it's a little bit more difficult. And you know, if you can actually get yourself into that calm state then, meditating whilst you have all of those distractions around you, you'll actually become much more better uh, person at meditating. And I think that that also extends itself into just being able to, to sit and be calm and happy with all of the noise and uh, what comes with that when you're inside of a city. Uh, you know, I think even if you just have a garden at your house, just go outside and sit down for five minutes and don't worry about all of the future stuff. A lot of people uh, commonly say that uh, depression is when you think about your past and anxiety is when you think about your future and I'm sure that we all have that anxiety that rapid pace where we kind of feel like we've always got to rush into the next thing because we're constantly thinking about the future and how we can make the future better you know people always say the present is called the present because it's a gift and so we should actually sit here and just be happy with what we've got be grateful for it and I think for the moments that I'm doing this right now I'm just sat here next to a, a little chapel here right next to the shard of all places uh, and I'm, I'm just feeling very thankful and, and calm and happy and it's something that I don't do too often and actually it feels really really good to just sit here and do this and not kind of feel like I have to rush to a meeting or do some work uh, it's actually kind of good to just sit here and decide when I want it to to pick up my phone and record this video so there you go that's something that I wanted to share with you today a reminder for you to go ahead and just sit be calm just allow your thoughts to to go over you just think about what you, why these certain thoughts are appearing in your brain are they a priority why did they make themselves become known because i find that when you actually um, are sitting quiet like i am now or if i'm meditating and actually you're preventing those thoughts from coming forward that's when your brain in a way it's tight and it just relaxes a little bit and all of these flow of new ideas come out to you and I think that's when you actually can have some eureka moments you can have those moments where uh, you, you get that crazy great idea for uh, a problem that you've been having uh, wherever that may be in your life or your career or your business whatever it may be you know it's in those moments of clarity that we get from just being still and happy with who we are compared to being constantly in the chaos that is everyone's life uh, you know we're constantly getting bombarded uh, especially in the age that we are now with our phones and smart watches that are constantly vibrating on our arms telling us about another new notification it's an update for this someone sent you a text message you've got a notification or a like on instagram or someone's you know messaging you on a dating app or something like that like there's so many distractions and you know just to do the opposite of that for a day could be incredible but just five minutes is such a small amount of time and not many people take that break frequently to be able to actually uh, fully appreciate what you can get from that 
to do that today that is my task for you today is to take five minutes to just sit pause this video go out into your garden a park maybe even just sit at your desk maybe just close your eyes put your hands on your lap and uh, just listen just listen to the surroundings that are happening try not to focus too much about what you've got to do in the future just be present thanks for watching this video be sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it and i hope to see you all in another video have a great day